Relief washed over Steve and Susan Posofsky as they got the news that the surgery went well. Your daddy loved you very much, huh? We met the Posofskys and their dog Cassidy on the eve of the procedure to give the five-year-old back the use of his leg. Well, this is a dog that was deemed unadoptable. It's as simple as that. During the four-hour operation, surgeons attached a titanium implant to the dog's lower leg bone. We let the bone rest and grow, merge with the implant for, you know, a three-month period or so it takes for that uh, implant to be uh, firmly anchored. Industrial engineers have collaborated with Dr. Marcel and Little to custom design the implant and the prosthetic leg and foot that will ultimately attach to it. Cassidy's surgery is the result of more than three years of work, but NC State developers hope is to take this technology from pets to people. The other thing for humans is that we think that we can actually make it cheaper in the future and these will be custom made and not having off-the-shelf components, these will be specific for one patient. Cassidy may be discharged from the hospital as early as tomorrow, but it will still only be on three legs. He'll come back in about three months to be fitted with the final prosthesis. At NC State Vet School, I'm Julie Henry, NBC 17 News.